Do you think GPT-4 is an AGI? Auto GPT. Auto GPT. Auto GPT. This is both exciting and terrifying. I won't lie, junior developers who do mostly testing, debugging, and writing simple code are most likely to get replaced by Auto GPT. Now, I know what you're thinking. Here's another video about, oh, AI will take your jobs, blah, blah, blah. But this isn't about that anymore. I have no intentions of fear mongering. You can either ignore what's about to come or embrace it and harness its advantage. If you choose to embrace it, keep watching. Auto GPT is a breakthrough in AI. On the 1st of April, 2023, a Twitter post about a new program called Auto GPT started trending. Soon, it was the most downloaded repository on GitHub. Within a couple of days, people have built websites, AI investment analysts, AI musicians, AI entrepreneurs, and much more without writing a single line of code. So what is this auto GPT? What does it even do? What does it mean for developers? And is this the beginning of a new era? Picture this, a machine that can write like Shakespeare, code like Bill Gates, and even create beautiful music like A.R. Rahman. This is auto GPT, an insanely advanced AI tool built by Torin Bruce Richards and his team of developers. But what can this AI powerhouse do right now? You won't believe it. AutoGPT can effortlessly write articles, generate code, correct itself, create poetry, and even compose music. It's like having an army of the world's most brilliant minds at your fingertips. Swagat hai aapka kal tak channel pe. Aaj humare saath hai Mr. Chintu Ramaswamy. Chintu has won the most talent shows in the world. Can you let us know a little bit about your achievements, sir? हाय गाइज मेरा नाम है चिंटू रामोस्वामी अमेरिका गॉट टैलेंट ने मुझे बेस्ट पेंटर का अवार्ड दिया इंडियन uh, आइडल में मुझे बेस्ट सिंगर का अवार्ड मिला और मास्टर शेफ चाइना में मुझे बेस्ट सुशी रेसिपी का अवार्ड मिला एंड आई एम अबाउट टू विन बेस्ट सालसा डांसर इन स्पेन वेरी सुन बट इतनी सारी अचीवमेंट हाउ कैन मैन पॉसिबली डू दैट All thanks to my lifelong mentor, Otto Gupta. You mean Otto GPT? No, no, he's Otto Gupta. He's playing Otto. We'll leave you tomorrow at night. So, Chintu Ji. So, to understand how Otto GPT does all this, we need to understand how we got here. Starting with ChatGPT. ChatGPT is an AI chatbot based on GPT 3.5. a language learning model or an LLM that was released by OpenAI in November 2022 it had a million users within a day to give you an idea of why this is so cool netflix took 3.5 years to get to a million users facebook took 10 months and instagram took 2.5 months a million users in a day is insane what makes chatgpt so incredible is that it can answer any question from how the universe began to how to build a web scraper on python and it does this in a conversational tone just like a human and it doesn't lose its temper like humans do dan sir ha program to badhiya banaya magar ye save wala feature add kar doge theek hai kar le okay acha ye ek aur change hai ye color mein maza nahi aa raha hai it doesn't reflect the neo modernism of the brand to wo bhi thoda sa theek hai ठीक है सर चेंज कर दूंगा सर ठीक है अच्छा नहीं लग रहा है यार मतलब ठीक है सर मैं चेंज करके दिखा दूंगा आपको अच्छा फोन चेंज कर दोगे ये पांच वेरिएशन दिखाओ ये बटन ना इधर लगा दो नहीं उधर लगाओ अरे इधर लगाओ ना चलो सर फाइनली डन मजा नहीं आ रहा यार चलो आई डोंट हैव टू इंटरेक्ट विथ ह्यूम एनी वर्ड ऑटो जीपीटी आई डोंट लाइक दिस बटन मजा नहीं आ रहा ओके हियर आर फाइव वेरिएशन ऑफ दिस बटन दैट फिट योर ब्रांड इमेज व्हिच वन वुड यू लाइक टू गो विद सर क्या बात है वुड यू आल्सो लाइक टू चेंज द फॉन्ट अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस कलर मतलब नेकी और पूछ पूछ कर दो भाई I think we should add Salman Khan on the hero page. I also think this feature will go really well in your project. Would you like to choose this font over this font? You look tired. Would you like me to order coffee for you? You look lonely and single. 
Would you like me to create a Tinder account for you? No. I can also simulate your ex-girlfriend and speak in her voice. Would you like that? Would you? No. Would you? Would you like that? Bhai, website bana do bas yaar. No changes. But before the world could even get used to ChatGPT, OpenAI released GPT-4. Now back to AutoGPT. AutoGPT is an open source app driven by GPT-4. What makes AutoGPT so useful and dangerous is its access to the internet and its ability to self-learn and something called continuous mode. It is potentially dangerous, which we'll get to later. So stick around. For now, let's look at this demo of AutoGPT building a website from a Twitter user called Sully. He names the AI Full Stack GPT and gives it a role of an autonomous AI used to build a website using React.js and Tailwind CSS and assigns it five objectives. And the AI gets to work and within three minutes, it arrives at three text boxes and a button, something that could easily pass for a legit website and arguably a better UI than some of our government websites. Throughout, you can see the AI's thoughts like I need to update and modify code. The AI's reasoning is that a Google search may be useful to provide some tips. Here is learning from the internet in real time. Remember, neither GPT 3.5 nor GPT 4 had access to the internet. Then the AI jots down a plan. Open index.js, write the necessary code, test the code and submit the solution. Now here's the insane part. When it doesn't get the code right the first time, it says I made an error in my previous response. I tried to analyze a piece of code that is clearly written in JSX syntax, which is incorrect, and then goes on to plan how to correct it. And continuous mode is when AutoGPD keeps working on a set of objectives without stopping. And you know why that's scary. AutoGPD is capable of reading and writing code, improving it, making it more efficient, testing it, correcting bugs and errors from the test, and saving this new code in a new file. All of this automatically with no human intervention. This is exactly what most developers do. The developers might be smarter and more accurate for now, but AutoGPT is constantly learning, doesn't get tired, and most importantly, it's cheaper than a developer. There are many developers already using this, experimenting, upskilling, and building better products with lesser effort. The existence of this technology poses a threat to most junior developer roles at enterprises and MNCs. Most college graduates who start out as software engineers in these companies are assigned to roles that involve a lot of repetitive and laborious tasks like testers, debuggers, and junior developers who write simple programs and functions. They're packaged under roles like Java developer, junior software engineer, etc. But they're mostly involved in these few tasks. A single experienced developer teamed up with AutoGPT can do what a team of five or six junior developers were able to do. And I repeat again, it never gets tired and it's always cheaper. This is exactly how AutoGPT will end up taking junior dev jobs. Tens of thousands of testing jobs, gone. Debugging jobs, gone. Junior developer jobs, gone. Yes, it is scary. However, not all hope is lost for all you aspiring software engineers. The job market will evolve with engineers needing to adapt and upskill themselves to stay relevant. But if a tool can pretty much run code, test, debug, and run all by itself, how exactly can developers upskill themselves? And upskill on what? The future will belong to those developers who can master existing tools like AutoGPT and Copilot to be more productive as a developer. It will belong to those who learn how to harness these tools to their fullest potential and build things on top of them. Instead of being afraid that AI may take away your job and remaining ignorant, a smart developer would learn how to use these emerging tools to their advantage in the professional space. ये पेंटिंग मैंने 10 साल की कड़ी मेहनत के बाद बनाई है इट रिप्रेजेंट्स द इमोशन ऑफ लॉन्गलीनेस इफ यू लुक एट द ब्रश स्ट्रोक्स इट विल सिंक यू इन इनटू एंडलेस डिप्रेशन इट इज वेरी वेरी सॉरी आई एम प्राइजिंग दिस एट 10 मिलियन डॉलर्स डेढ़ सौ में कस्टमाइजेबल मॉडर्न आर्ट कस्टमाइजेबल डू लाइफ स्टोरी कस्टमाइजेबल डू डिप्रेशन कस्टमाइजेबल डू ब्रेकअप जॉब लॉस एवरीथिंग डेढ़ सौ में डेढ़ सौ में ए, यो, ये आर्टिस्ट कौन है <laughs> वो बहुत बड़े आर्टिस्ट है ऐसे बता नहीं सकते बट एक बात बताओ यहाँ पे वाईफाई सही है यस फाइव जी है ना यस बढ़िया बढ़िया डेढ़ सौ में कस्टमाइजेबल बाहर मिलना बाहर मिलना डेढ़ सौ में कस्टमाइजेबल मॉडर्न आर्ट It's changing faster than ever. Never in human history have we had a technology that could learn by itself, correct itself, and dare I say, think by itself. 
In a lot of ways, it poses a threat to human intelligence. This is where the word artificial general intelligence or AGI starts getting thrown around. It is terrifying because of the power that super intelligent AGI wields to destroy human civilization. AI tools are great for specific tasks. ChatGPT is great for email and writing. Midjourney is great for generating images and so on. These are all narrow AI. They're specialized in one domain. But in AGI, much like a human can do anything, learn anything instantly. From coding a website, to learning graphic design, to making UIs, to ordering things from Amazon, AGI can potentially do everything a human can do. AGIs have been depicted like this, this, and this in movies. But in reality, we're yet to see what AGI looks like. People in the tech space, including the famous investor Naval, rejected the idea that AGI could be achieved through these tools like GPT. But since the release of GPT-4 and tools like AutoGPT, everyone has had to reevaluate. Fast forward 10 years, AI tools will be even more powerful. Imagine an AI that can design entire cities, optimize healthcare systems, or discover groundbreaking scientific breakthroughs. The possibilities are virtually limitless. It's like giving Einstein, Da Vinci, and Newton a chance to collaborate on projects together. Now that would be something. Until then, keep watching and stay subscribed.